There is a magical operation of maximum importance. The initiation of a new aeon. When it becomes necessary to utter a word, the whole planet must be bathed in blood. Ironic that now I was the one suffering. Not anything as pedestrian as physical pain, rather the cruel jab of impotent anger. The hunger for revenge. I didn't care if I was in heaven or hell. All I wanted was to kill my assassins. Sometimes you get what you wish for. The necromancer Mortanius offered me a chance for vengeance, and like a fool, I jumped at his offer without considering the cost. Nothing is free, not even revenge. <laughs> you will have the blood you hunger for. Napraptor, your madness has shattered our dreams and blinded you. Keep your distance, or I'll send you back to hell, spirit! There is nothing left of me to fear, vampire. I'm only a shadow of my former self, Ari, the balance of the Circle of Nine. Even so, I can provide the answers you seek. I seek only a cure. There is no cure for death, only release. You must destroy the sorcery, the sorcery that is now poisoning Nosgoth. Only then will you realize peace. The nine of the Protectors of Hope were sworn to use their powers to preserve our world. Now these pillars have been corrupted by a traitor. My murder at the hands of this beast drove my love Napraptor mad. Now he spreads misery and pain among the circles crumbling the very foundation of Nosgoth. You must restore balance. 
you must right the pillars of Nosgoth. I care not for the fate of this world. Then for yourself, Cain. Beware the unspoken. A nobleman seeking wisdom? Death has taught you well. Enough philosophy. I seek answers. Answers, indeed. I have them all if you have the questions. And what are the questions for these answers? King Atmar, the only hope to defeat the legions of the Nemesis. King Atmar, paralyzed by his princess's malaise. King Atmar, the useless. Pray, good sir, what are the questions? A pox upon your tricks and babble, old man. Answer me this. Who is Malik, and how can I defeat him? All in time, sirrah. Yes, time. Unless you master it, it will master you. And now it's time for your answer. Malik, defender of the Nine, and last of the Seraphim Sorcerer Priests, his vanity led to the slaughter of the Circle at the hands of the vampire Vorotor. For his failing, his spirit was fused to a hellish set of magical armor. He has allowed no member of the Circle to fall since. What of this Vorotor? Follow the glow of the Ignis Fatuous to the Termagant Forest. Ignis Fatuous? The Ignis Fatuous lights the path to hell, nobleman. Your path. Time, Kay? Next time. In the bowels of that black forest, I found something worse than hell. A vision of what I was becoming. It's not often I see one of our own, especially one as young and foolish as yourself. Nonetheless, drink. Drink deep and indulge your gift. Gift? <laughs> Vorador thought my curse a blessing. That we were gods. That mortals offered their blood as sacrifice so that we could enjoy our supernatural powers. And somewhere, Deep inside my new self, I knew he was right. That mortal dreams were prayers. Prayers to us, begging us for power. I pondered this as the decadent old fool prattled on about his past. A boorish account of how he defeated Malek of the Seraphim and took his vengeance upon the Circle of Nine for supporting the Saracen Holy War to exterminate Malik! us. Malik! Feast on your corpses! After slaughtering six of the sheep, I defeated their pathetic little shepherd, Malik. 
Since then, our kind has not bothered with the cat, except to feed. And I suggest you do the same. Meddling with the affairs of man can do us no good. Seraphan witch hunts are much too tedious to concern ourselves with. Am I understood, Cain? Good. Take this ring. If you ever need assistance, it will summon you. Despite your youthful arrogance, you amuse me, Cain. It is such a pity to lose you to this. Now be gone! 